This is JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Dean Perrine, and welcome to JSA TV. We are coming at you live from Encompass 2016 in the Lone Star State of Texas in Dallas, Texas. And I'm here with uh, my new friend, Mr. Brandon Ross. Brandon it has one of the greatest titles I've read all day today. Brandon is the Chief Network Architect and CEO for Net Network Utility Force. Brandon, welcome to JSA TV. Thanks, it's great to be here. Outstanding. So um, there, there's more than just one company we're, we're here to talk about today. Um, another company named Walker. Why don't you tell us, tell our viewers a little bit about Network Utility Force and your relationship with Walker? Sure, that's right. So uh, Network Utility Force is Walker and Associates Professional Services Partner. So we handle installation, network design, and network configuration for just about anything that Walker sells, which is a huge line of equipment from Juniper and Brocade to uh, optical network vendors to a whole bunch of different things. Very good. And so how is the show going for you today? It's going great. I had a great lunch and there was just ice cream. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> how, how bad could it be when there is ice exactly, cream, right? That's exactly. awesome. Yeah, seriously, though, I love uh, coming to events like this and interacting with all the different service providers that attend. Um, our core of our business is, is service providers and uh, most of our team, our professional services team, come from a service provider background. Okay. So this is definitely our crowd. Outstanding, very good. So um, why don't you tell our viewers a little bit more about what it is that you do and why it is that they might be interested in your services? Sure, absolutely. So Network Utility Force, again, is a professional services company. So we don't personally sell any hardware or software. That's why we partner with Walker. What we sell is our brain power. Uh, we do network design. We do network architecture. Um, we divide that into a few different areas. We have a group that's focused on core networking, so that's routing and switching, network automation, which of course is becoming a big deal these days. We have another group that focuses on wireless, and that's not just Wi-Fi in buildings, the way uh, a lot of folks do, but also we have guys that climb the towers and put in point-to-point -point and point-to-multipoint networks. And then the third area focuses on kind of developing technologies, which includes Network security, um, but the big the big words of the day: SDN, NFV, yeah. virtualization, and storage, which is a, a very rapidly growing area, and I'm sure everybody around here is talking about today. We they, we are hearing a lot about that, but what's your bent? I mean, what is it? What is it specifically around, like say SDN, that uh, that you can help folks accomplish? Well, sure. So, uh, you know, again, we really focus on the service provider, the carrier market, uh, and building products that carriers can then offer to their clients. So while you might run into some enterprise consultants that are just trying to buy, build private clouds for their, for their enterprise, which makes a lot of sense and is a good business, we build uh, clouds that uh, customers, that our customers, our carrier customers, can turn into public clouds and sell cloud services or SDN services to their clients. Very good. Brandon, thanks for being with us on JSA TV. Thanks. Great to be here. Thanks a lot. Outstanding. Have a good time at the receptions tonight. Uh, you bet I will. <laughs> Outstanding. All right. So thanks again, Brandon. Absolutely.